Hey everybody, Sammy Tari here, and welcome to part 3 of the Final Fantasy 1 playthrough, part of the dual pack Dawn of Souls for the GBA. Um, so anyways, uh, yeah, I spent last night, uh, grinding my character levels, and now everybody is at level 15. They are probably way above what they have to be. Um, so yeah, so I bought the broadsword for my red mage, bought blizzard for my red mage, bought, like, almost 20 aethers, I have like 11 phoenix downs, and now I'm at level 15, so now all we have to do is we have to sail in order to find the village of Melmond to the west, which is what we're doing right now, because that is where our next quest is. Uh, if you remember from the last episode, we defeated a pirate and gained his ship. And I guess ships can only land at ports, which are these little block things. I should have known. Ambush. So I'm worried that these things will do, like, a shit ton of damage, but... I should probably be attacking the shark, but, you know. I don't know, okay. Well, so far they're not doing too much damage. I expected a lot worse, I guess. 93 experience, okay. So, west is this way. And so we're going to see what we can find. I love how I'm always ambushed. Yesterday I always got preemptive strike, and today I'm just always ambushed. Oh, and I bought my warrior a battle axe. Like, I don't know, for some odd reason I thought battle axes could only be equipped by something else. I, I was thinking in terms of, like, Final Fantasy, like... Um, I was thinking in terms of, like, Final Fantasy 3, and I'm like, oh, only, you know, these types of people can equip battle axes, and that's not true. Okay, so this is West. But, there's nothing here. There's this, which is where we were before. <sighs> okay, so now we're gonna go up. So this is the only problem, is that I'm not really, like, 100% sure where this village is. So we might be looking around for a while, and while we can sail, we might have to end up walking to Melmon, which is the village of the last. First, I want to see if we can find a port by a village, and then if we can't, then yeah. I wish this thing had a map, though. Okay, so no, this is the village where we came from. Okay, well that solves that. We have no choice but to go this way and uh, part our dock at the port. And then walk west. So if you don't remember, this is where we first crossed the bridge. Um, this is where we first crossed the bridge and I was really freaking out because of all the monsters and we couldn't find a place, we couldn't find a village, and I thought I was going the wrong way. Um, I almost went west, and now I'm glad that I didn't. Um, yeah. I don't know. So anyways, yeah, so I equipped my warrior with the... Well, thank you, AVG. I know you did. But please go away. I don't want you. Thank you. Yeah, like, recently, I, I don't know, I haven't had the web in, like, three weeks, but for some odd reason, my AVG all of a sudden was like, Danger, danger! You know, there's a... You have a Trojan virus on your computer. And I was like, okay, I don't see how that's possible. Because I have no internet, I haven't been able to pick up anything, like, unless it was just hiding away somewhere and just decided to jump out at me, like... Okay, so this is what has me highly confused, like, I am in the west. So unless I... Oh, there's that cave where the earth was decaying. I could always go there. Yeah, because there's nothing up here. I remember that there's nothing up here. Yeah, last night I also checked out the uh, I checked out the bestiary on here, and I was like, man, I don't have I don't have documentation of all the monsters. I didn't defeat everything. Damn it. And I also learned last night that potions are extremely like highly needed on this game. Like werewolves poison you, fucking snakes poison you. Preemptive strike. These things can poison you. Yeah, like any spider can poison you. Snakes obviously poison you. 
and the green wolves that are called werewolves for some odd reason. They poison you. Oi. Oh my gosh. This is gonna take forever, you guys. Please stop hitting me already. Oh, this gets annoying. Granted, my red mage really hasn't used any magic yet, so technically if it came down to it, like, I could use him to cure people while saving the MP of my white mage, but I really just don't want to. So that cave that we used to visit is also in the west. Just gotta remember that our boat is here. Still can't believe that you can't really do anything. I mean, obviously there's this whole different section of sea, but the thing is, is we have no plate. We have no way to get to it. So. can't imagine having to have, like, grind in this area or whatever. Okay, this is what I'm talking about. The cave. But it's not a village, so... If I can't find Melmond, like... I, I don't know. Please be Melmond. No, that's the Earth Gift Shrine. And this guy's gonna tell me the same thing. This is the Earth Gift Shrine. Long ago, we could you, you could enter, but it's been shut since the Earth began to decay. Began to decay. The Petrus stench of decaying Earth hangs heavily in the air. Okay, so we still can't go in here. And the Chaos Shrine has nothing to offer us, which means it's back in the boat for us. And trying to see whether we can head west. I wish there was a map. Like, I just want to see a map. Like, I know that Final Fantasy 3 has this really nice map where every time you see a village or something, it's marked on said map, so you can see where you've been, and red marks dungeons in places of, like, importance. So, even though I wouldn't know where to go next via this thingy, I would still have an idea of where I've been. Yeah, it's like, I, okay, I can go all the way over here, but really there's nothing. Like, see, this is depressing. Okay, I'm gonna go down then. Oh, and I can park at the castle. Oh, nope, we're heading west though. I have a feeling we're gonna end up heading way out to sea, and we're so gonna get lost. But there's that lack of direction, it's like, oh, just go to the west, it'll be fine, like, just head there. It'll be great, you guys. Okay, so now that we're on the other side of the mountains, I want to investigate, and I want to see if we can find Melon. And if we can't, we get back in the boat. And then, we, yeah. I might spend this whole episode just traveling. Hell if I know. No mon. Well, here's a pond. Which had monsters in it. Ugh. It's way too early for this shit. Like, I don't know, I just woke up. Okay, I'm gonna need to heal people. Like, see, that shouldn't have happened. I mean, I'm glad that they're earning experience and all that, but... Oh well, it only takes like 3 MP per, so... I don't see a village here. Hi, Cobra. Wow, well, boys. Okay, here's this. Where are you? Mountain Durgar? Lollyho. 
Have you blethered we or Smith Smith? And Smithy he is. We crystal A in the blind can see. I hear that the dark elf asked us to kill the one belonging to Matoya. I hate their accent, like I can't understand them. That sound? A, hey, that's Narek. He's smashing rocks in the back of the cave. Like, I know we're not supposed to be here, but when it comes to defense, a, guy, a, good, arm, a good armlet can be ivory, blah, blah, blah. You should try one out sometime. That sound? I, hey, that's Narek. Uh, looking for some levy stone. It's supposed to be amazing material that actually floats in the air. What's this? Huh. Huh? Okay. So I'm heading deeper and deeper into a place that I'm not really supposed to be in in the first place. I know I'll have to come back here. The store has been bound by a mystic key. All these places bound by a fucking mystic key. Derek, ugh, there's a giant rock in my path. And now I'm so close to opening up my canal, too. If I had a wee bit of nitro powder, I could nap that rock in one block. Okay, so we have to get nitro powder. Nitric powder, nitric powder, or nitro powder, or whatever the fuck you just said. We need that stuff. Which means we can't be here because we can't progress until he gets the canal open. But what I can do is I can go around and see if I can buy armor and weapons. If only I could have some of the legendary metal adamantite, I'd be able to make such a magical sword. Okay, so we can't be here either because Smithy... Um... Smithy can't smith stuff for us because, uh, he needs adamantite. But I got 575 gil, and 450 gil. I will talk to you. The crystal, even the blind, can see. I hear that the dark elf Astos built the one belonging to Latoya. And I run into a freaking battle. But we got a lot of gill, so I'm not complaining. It wasn't completely wasted. Plus, we know that we now have to go to this place. Okay, and there's a whirlpool there. I'm gonna save just because we have so much gill. Always save after important shit. Our ship can probably sail through that, even though it can't get through the whirlpool. I might have to end up using like my potions or my tents or something, because like, I can't use cure forever. And I know I'm going to run into a monster like every three minutes. Look at that shield skill. It's fantastic. Okay, so Whirlpool there, these places here, there's nothing over here, hello, villages, hello, Melmond, and the thing is, is I'm not really running into any, like, really hard monsters at all. So, like, if I were, I'd be concerned, or I'd be like, oh, hey, I'm heading in the right direction at least, but I'm not, I'm not hitting anything harder than what I was experiencing before. Oh god, I'm ambushed by an ogre and a gigas worm. I'm so scared. Oh my gosh, you're fucking kidding me. Stop it already. This is one of those moments where I wish I had something like in Pokemon where I had a repel or some shit. Yeah, I was comparing this to Pokemon the other night. I was just like, man, I was like, if this was Pokemon, I'd always be running into shinies because obviously the uh, 
the character designs are always the same. Like, almost always the same. So it's like, you know, a ghoul and a ghast, the only difference is the color. You know, so it's one of those things where I was just like, man, you know, go figure a Final Fantasy game is the only game where I can find a shiny. And so I was basically trying to make a joke to myself. And I was sitting there, and I'm like, oh, what can I use in my videos? What would be funny? And I'm like, oh, the only shinies I can find are in Final Fantasy, ha ha ha. And then I was like, I don't think that's very funny, so... See? Like this. Like this one's an Ogre Chief. So everybody, go kill the Ogre Chief. Yeah, like, my warrior and my monk, they're so heavily armored that they have, like, really good defense. You know, but it's like my red mage, when someone finally does notice him and hits him, he doesn't really have much HP to begin with, because he doesn't get very much. He has a little bit more defense than my white mage, but he still doesn't have much in the way of defense. So if he gets hit, he's gonna take, like, big amounts of damage, just because. I'm sad. And I still haven't found any armor for my freaking, uh... Yeah, for my freaking white mage. I need to find a village. A village with a port. And I can't cross here. Like, even though it's, even though it's blue, little, like, calm blue water, I need, like, a tiny boat to go through it. So where the hell is Nomon? Or am I supposed to go to the elves first? Mm. I'm gonna sail a little bit more, but if I can't find it, like, I'm gonna end up having to, um... I seriously can't find a village or anything, like, I'm seriously gonna have to end up saving and calling it quits. Until I have a guide or something to tell me where the hell I'm supposed to go. Because I know I can find a village, but it's like, watch it be the wrong one where there's, like, nothing for me to do, and even if there is, I'm really out-leveled for it. Or, I mean, not out-leveled, but under-leveled for it. We're gonna go this way first. Okay, so there's mountains there, and we can't go this way first. And again, we're still running across the same enemies we were before, so we should still be in the right area. And considering the fact that we can't, like, go through the blue water, and we can't cross mountains yet, uh, that's kind of a good indicator that we are still in the area we're supposed to be. But I still don't like it. Cool, preemptive strike. So everybody's leveled up. Now everybody's level 16. I'm probably gonna be like level 20 by the time I actually find a place. Oh my god. So I'm gonna go down here. I can sail around, can't I? So I found a city, but I wanna port my boat right by the city. And hopefully this is Melmond. Either that or City of the Elves. Either way, it's soft. No, I can't. Alright, well, it's better than nothing. Please let this place be Melmond, or some place where I need to be. But the guy said that Melmond was where the earth was decaying, and then they said the elves lived across the sea, so this is either the elven city or this is Melmond. Oh, go ahead, ambush me, you're just a warg. Oh my god, look, shiny wolf! Like, I'm gonna do that now. So, I don't know, I, I think I mentioned this in the last video, but my favorite Final Fantasy enemy is a needle monkey. Like... I don't know, they're just, they're adorable to me. So my favorite Final Fantasy enemy is thus a needle monkey. And so I decided that if ever I had a huge amount of followers, I would call them needle monkeys. I'd be like, oh, hey, there my needle monkeys. Like, I don't know why. Because it's like, Onision has his bananas, you know, PewDiePie has his bros, and, you know, everybody has their own name for their followers or whatever. And it's like, I don't have any followers, but I also don't have a name for if I did have followers. Elfheim. So we are officially here. 
Okay, so I'm going to tell you about the theory that I came up with last night. The princess gave us the loot, and the prince, the elf prince, is in a coma, or the elf king or whatever is in a coma. So I'm assuming that this magical loot will wake him up, but this is just my theory. I just don't know what we can do. Please help our prince. Okay, the elf prince. Hi, I want to buy your shit. Iron Nunchaku. Crochier. Saber. Well, he didn't really give us anything we could really use except giving him an iron ninjutsu. And I guess that's the start. So yeah, I am gonna go shopping first. I should actually heal first, but... It's 100 gil a night? Are you fucking kidding me? Like, I know the inns will get more and more expensive. Actually, I'm hoping they're like Final Fantasy 3, where it really just depends on the location. Because I really just don't want to be spending like 100 gil. I guess I really can't complain, because like, the place that I'm staying now in Final Fantasy 3 is like 200 a night. Something like that. I am a sage. When the time is right, the future is revealed to me. I shall wait patiently until then. Sure. Iron armor, he already has. Copper armlet, who would only help. Do need three of these. No, I don't want eleven, I want three. Thank you. Three, and... I should have only bought two, since he already has one. A helm. An iron shield and a copper arm. So still, we don't have very much for freaking iron shield and a helm. Another cap and then a copper armlet as your clothes, which you don't understand. So Taz basically now has more stuff. And you finally have a leather cap. Why would the clothes bring your I guess okay, they bring his evading up and I don't think I have anything for you to equip. Other than the letter cap. Because you can't have a shield for whatever weird reason. I will sell some stuff though. I'm gonna sell my extra leather cap. I'll sell my clothes. And also my other shield, just because. And the old nun jacket. Okay, I don't really have anything else. And I didn't really spend too much money. I'm surprised. Is this the church, or is this where the prince is? This is the church. Okay. So we've bought our magic, we've bought our weapons, we've healed our party, and... Ooh, more healing spells. Okay, so now we're gonna go and we're gonna buy some white magic. Can we read these? You see a gravestone. Okay, you see a gravestone. Here lies Link. What? Oh my god, it's so hell. Okay. Hi. Kira? Oh, I shouldn't have done that. Okay. Um. Uh. Uh. Hold on, I've gotta hold this for a minute. Um. Sorry, someone texted me. Um. 
it's my woman, it's Taz, the, he the healer that just is now yelling at me, because like, why didn't you give me Cura, but you give the red mage Cura, because you're a dumbass. Um, I love you too. Um, I can't wait to hear you tonight. That sounds kind of dirty. Mm-mm-mm-mm. Okay. Which that doesn't really make much sense, because right now it's like 11.26, which means that she probably went on lunch early. Like, that's weird. Okay, I need to write this down before I forget, but okay, so I always write down my goals. Uh, we did not find Melon, but we found Elpheim, so bye, Cura, and other spells. Another spells for Taz in Elfheim for 3 kg. Yay! Not kg as in kilograms, but 3,000. Uh, freaking. I love Woo. Whoa, this thing has a weird spelling. But, uh, yeah. Okay, so I have to buy heal, a dais or whatever, and blah blah blah. I still think that's funny. Here lies Link. Like, I don't know why, but that tickled me. Okay, so we gotta find this elf kingdom. Um, no one knows where Astos, King of the Dark Elves, is gone. Oh, so that's what the dwarves were talking about. So I wonder where if I even have to be here. Like, maybe not. Our prince is meant to become the elf king, but what will happen now? Do you have cheaper stuff? No. Shit. What do all these do? Cures poison. Okay, I need that. Um, I will need that a lot. Fear. No frost. Fox. Okay, I know that I will need Poisona and Vox. I'm not sure what I'll do with freaking hmm. No Frost or whatever. Like, I'm not really a strategist, so... Hold on, White Mage, Red Wizard, Red Knight. Oh, this is telling you what people can learn it. Oh, so they open up new classes later on, so... Okay, cool. A prince was meant to become the king. I'm a sage, when the time is right, blah, blah blah, and what you have more fire things. Sleepra, Haze, Confuse, and Blizzara. So I'm going to be here for a while. I'm gathering magics. Elven Castle. My game's lagging. Cause my laptop's getting too hot. Astos curses put our prince into a deep sleep from which he cannot wake. Please will you not attempt to aid our slumbering prince? Um I'll try, but like I said, the only thing I think that'll work is the loot. The Dark Elf King Astos stole into the castle and placed a curse on our prince, and Astos carted away the castle's treasures. Well, that dick. Okay, so we're gonna see if we can help the prince, and if we cannot... I don't know. The prince has slept under Astos' curse for five years now. There must be some medicine that can rouse the sleeping, but where? Okay, so we have to find a medicine. The thing is, is like, I don't- I'm not really familiar with this area, so I can't really tell you where the medicine might be. Or where I would even begin to find it. Okay. Well. Um, the best I can think to do is ask around and see if I can find out where this medicine is. Okay. Yeah, like that's the that's the best I can think to do. Because unless I can find this like dark elves like like unless I can find this dark elves hideout or some shit, there's really nothing else I can do except for fight monsters, level up, and buy like all the magic I need. 
So, um, I'm gonna go ahead and save here since I got all that shit. Um, double save. Okay, so today we are quitting in the field, but basically this has been Sam Atari playing Final Fantasy 1. Um, I don't really know what to say. Obviously we've made it to Elfheim, which is one of the two places that was mentioned. Melmond was the first, Elfheim was the second. Um, we have to find a way to awaken the prince, so that means we have to find, like, a medicine that'll wake him up, since my theory about the loot is, uh, totally incorrect. So. Oh, sorry. I'm just really tired. Um, but yeah. Uh, so I guess the plan is to explore the area. I mean, our ship's up here, the city's just right here. I mean, I have a lot of magic I can buy, which will be good, so as I level up I can, you know, put my uh, healers and stuff to more use, or whatever. So, yeah, so basically that's all we're gonna do is the next video I think we're gonna explore the area. We're going to try and find a place where we can find a medicine for the prince. Since I do not have web, I cannot guarantee that I will find this place, so you might just have a video where I'm just running around killing a bunch of monsters and getting myself lost. But hey, either way, it's not that bad, right? Um, so go ahead and hit like if you are liking this series so far. I am actually very much enjoying this game. I actually woke up early just to play it. Um, since I leveled up last night, and I think I will spend another night just kind of grinding and buying shit that I need. Um, I will obviously want to have all those spells bought before I, um, before I attempt to make another video and buy, or, and find the medicine that the Prince needs. Um, uh huh. And last but not least, go ahead and leave me a comment. Um, and it's not really last, but go ahead and leave me a comment, let me know what you think of the series thus far. If you do have any hints on things that I could do better, whether it be in my video games, like, whether, you know, yeah, whether it be, like, through gaming, like, how I could strategize a little better, or even if it's through my videos, like, things I could do better. I know that I watched my Guild Wars videos last night, and they were fucking terrible, the last two of them. Um, the volume was all wonky, because I was trying a new microphone, and, uh, so I really... You like you can you can't hear me, and so I'm really gonna have to apologize for that and do better in part 20. I'm going to have to really start focusing on my volume control, like I have been in Paper Mario and in this playthrough. Um, so yeah, so go ahead and just let me know what you think of the videos in general, um, and of this video game series in the comments below, whether or not you beat it, whether or not you have any hints or tips on what to do better, and last but not least, finally, what is really last, go ahead and connect with me online. I post vlogs almost all the time, or at least I try to, um, on my personal opinions on games, you know, just different gaming things that have to do with gaming discussion, gaming news, game reviews, and etc., so... Anyways, this is Sam Atari out, and I will talk to you guys later. Alright. Ciao, you guys.